This is my Arbor Press. I did a video on this before when I first got it on why you might want to get an Arbor Press if you're a leather worker. But basically the gist of it is anything you can do with a hammer, you can do with an Arbor Press and it's a lot quieter and a lot cleaner. Um, but since we've had this, we had a comment on that other video by Nestor Kropotkins. And he said he has a one ton Harbor Freight Arbor Press that he installed um, a little drill chuck into and so I thought that that was a really good idea because basically you can just chuck up any size of tool, whether it's a, a corner cutter or like a stitching hole, punch, anything you can fit inside of a chuck, you can put it in there and not have to worry about it. And so since then, I picked up this chuck from Amazon. It was like 30 bucks. I think it's like a, it's a 3 16 by 3 quarter inch uh, chuck. I had to machine the spindle down that it, it attaches to, to fit inside of this. Um, but other than that, it was a pretty easy attachment and it's made the biggest difference in the shop. So let's go through the list of things that we've used on it. You can use a hole punch. You can use your stitching punch when you're like stitching wallets or whatever. You can use it as a rivet setter for the brass rivets and the, the regular pop rivets. You can use an oval punch. You can use it as a logo, logo punch for like those little brass logos. You can do a belt in punch, um, corner punches, slot punches, basically anything you can use a hammer on. But then I'm sure there's tons of things that I'm not thinking of that you could use these for. Um, you could eat food with it, I don't know. But yeah, this has, been, this has been a really, really useful tool in the shop and we use it literally all day, every day. I recommend going out and get one if you're gonna do any sort of production. If you're, if you're just doing a little bit here and there, maybe not Maybe don't spend the $300 to get one of these, but if you if you do a little production, going out and buying a used one of these, we got this one for 100 bucks on our local classifieds, and it's been a huge lifesaver. So, buy an Arbor Press if you want. Hell yeah!